hello listener in our previous video we have discussed the graphical method of graphical method of finding solution of a pair of linear equation okay by seeing any equation you have to find out whether that type of equation is intersecting one or here yeah, coincide one or it is a parallel line parallel line in our previous class we have discussed there are three possibilities okay either your line intersect with each other coincide with each other or parallel with each other intersect and coincide is called as consistent pair of consistent pair of linear equation and it is called as inconsistent pair of linear equation okay by seeing that equation means without drawing any graph without drawing the graph by seeing we have to say whether it is a unique one whether it is a infinite whether it has no solution whether it is a consistent pair of linear equation whether it is a inconsistent pair of linear equation pair of linear equation so for that you are having one technique called as comparing ratios technique comparing ratio technique for comparing and there should be a relation between coefficient and nature of system of equations means you have to used comparing ratios technique comparing ratios technique so without drawing the graph by seeing any equation you have to find you have to show whether that equation is a, a unique solution or it is a consistent linear pair of equations or it is a dependent or it is a coincide one or it is a inconsistent one for that we are using a comparison ratios techniques means pair of linear equations so first we have to obtain the equation in a general form in their general form and we have to find out the coefficient of a coefficient we have to find out the coefficient of x what is the coefficient of x coefficient of x is a1 and the coefficient of y is b1 and what is your constant constant is c1 means you have to remember the coefficient of a variables then only you can find out the nature of that equations whether that equation is a consistent one or inconsistent one okay how you will you have to find out the coefficient suppose if a1 the coefficient of x1 and the coefficient of x2 a1 upon a2 is not equal to b1 upon b2 if your equation satisfy this condition then it is called as unique solution unique solution it is a intersecting graph okay intersecting graph it is also called as consistent pair of linear equation and it is independent independent okay this is second type of graph if you are a1 upon a2 is equal to b1 upon b2 is equal to constant 1a upon constant 2 this is called as consistent it is also called as consistent graph dependent graph dependent graph this kind of graph is a coincident graph it has many solution many or infinite infinite number of solution infinite number of solution this is second type of if this condition satisfied 
it is a coincident type of graph. Without drawing a graph by seeing that equations, if it satisfy this condition, it is a intersecting graph. If it satisfy this second condition, it is a coincident graph. Next one is your third one. Okay. What is your third one? A 1 upon A 2 is equal to B 1 upon B 2 is not equal to constant 1 upon constant 2. If that your equation satisfies this condition, it means that it has no solution, it is a parallel, it is a parallel or it is a inconsistent linear pair of equation, inconsistent pair of linear equation, inconsistent, inconsistent pair of linear equation equation, inconsistent pair of linear equation. If you are means by seeing the relation between coordinate, we are finding the relation between coefficient. By seeing the relation between coefficient, we are finding the nature of equation means what type of equation it is. It is intersecting pair of linear equation, it is coincident pair of linear equation, it is a no solution. This is your next topic. In coming classes, we will do important problems related to this topic. Just click on my bell icon for updated videos.